video, I'm just making a video of my tackle box, and um, to start off, I'm starting with this one little tackle box, here I have some hooks, here I have some perch cords, swim, swim baits, um, here I have some Crawfish collar jig trailers, speed crawl jig trailer, and then this jig trailer. Right here, I have some jigs, black and blue jigs. Here's a black and blue, just a black and blue jig. Um, here's two that look exactly the same that my grandpa gave to me a few days ago. A, um, jig. Another one. This is a football head jig from Walmart. This is either a football head jig. Not a football head jig, but this is either a bestie flip or a booyah baby boo jig. No, this is the bestie flip, I think. Then here I just have a... Jig hit, swim jig. I have some rattle traps. Here I have a. Okay, I'm gonna just get all these out. Here's a cotton cordel rattle trap. And here I have a, um. Cotton Cordell Rattle Trap. I found that's just old and dirty. Here I have a Bill Lewis Lures Rattle Trap. And this. Ow. Ow. Sorry, I just got hooked twice. Now I have this Rattle Trap. Sorry, y'all. I just got hooked twice. And I think it almost drew wood. Luckily, I don't think it did. Good thing it was a fresh hook. Good thing it wasn't a dirty hook. Because honestly, I do not want to have to put rubbing alcohol on my finger right now. Okay, here I have a riveted swim jig. I mean, swim bait. Shad. Here I have some spiral lock finesse football head jigs. Some plastic worm weights. And then some jig heads. All here that I'm getting out now is just crankbaits. Here I have a splatterback bandit. A perch colored square bill a bomber I think here another perch colored square bill a KVD square bill and then two bombers sorry if y'all hear that music playing in the background I was watching TV And then that's all in this tackle box. This tackle box now. On um, this side is just soft plastic. I have my Shadowicious swim baits. My blue glitter 
plastic worms, June bug color, I think, plastic worm, that works good at Lake Providence, if you're in Louisiana, um, orange pumpkin, I mean green pumpkin, these watermelon red speed crawls, Watermelon red and pearl frog ribbit frogs. Some of these. I have no idea what color that is. And then I have no idea what color this is. Most of my worms are zoom. And then this one that came in a tackle box. Okay, I'm going to go to the other side, which is just everything else. I'll carry this in case, you know, I need somebody or something. Or I get lost fishing. Or I'll lose somebody, contact to somebody. Hold on. Here I just have a little hook assortment for bluegill and bass. This ain't even mine. This is my buddy's spinnerbait. Just a little Walmart charge one dollar Walmart chargers spinnerbait. A one dollar black and blue buzz bait. Hold on. That's a good one. Court or bobbers, whatever you want to call them. This little floating minnow or diving minnow, whatever you want to call it. A baby zero spook. A head and torpedo. Three pop bars. Make that four pop bars. Some snaps and swivels. Some wobble heads. A white and then a black and yellow H and H center bait. Those colors are really good. I know uh, I have a buddy that's called a five, six pound bass off of a white H&H &H spinnerbait. This red ant, Booyah Pond Magic, red ant color, and then the black and yellow one. Let me put all this back in here real quick, and then I'll show y'all one, two more things. Okay, on this side I have some stringers, and then you might have recognized this frog already. Before I even get a chance to show you. This is how you just an H2O frog. And then this is a KVD sexy frog in a leopard color. And it's a nice lure. Has a rattle. Really soft. Now if you have an H2O frog. And a KVD sexy frog. Any color. That has a flat back like that. If you notice, press down on this back and see how hard it is. And then press down on this back and see how soft it is. This one has a rattle. This one don't. So on a windy day, like when, or a day, 
there's a bunch of no there's not very much noise and you want their and you want their and you want to get their attention or something because they can't see it maybe that's a good frog and then that's it those are my tackle boxes well till next episode bye